How's it going everyone? My name is Swingpoint and welcome back to some more To The Moon. If I recall, Rosaline just had a- just had a moment where she was sitting there thinking out by the lighthouse, trying to figure out why the heck we cannot figure out Johnny's brain for the life of us. Ugh, you can smell that squirrel Neil ran over all the way from here now. Ew! <laughs> but if I recall, what we are going to be doing is we're going to go find Watts because Rosaline was like, uh, I don't know, maybe Watts knows. So I don't know where Watts would be sitting, but I got a feeling he's not upstairs. I'm going to look in here. There he is. No, I understand that part, but... Okay, did you confirm his records? And wh why again was this information not made available to us? Or the medical doctor for that matter? Well, sounds like it's gonna be relevant. Where did you- where'd you get that coffee? Shh, shh, shh. <laughs> Are you speaking with headquarter? Yeah, yeah, just- I'll fill you in after, shut up! <laughs> now, shh. <laughs> She's so pissed, she doesn't like being told shh. That it? Oh, he's still talking. Okay. <laughs> Wait, isn't this... Where, where'd you find this? In the lighthouse before we started. Now, for the last time... Shh! <laughs> so I'm really waiting for the moment where Watts has this brilliant breakthrough and is all of a sudden useful. Because lately, or not lately, the entire time he's just been kind of a dumbass. So I'm, I'm convinced that Watts is going to have this amazing moment where he's just brilliant. But we have yet to see it. <laughs> But Ma, I don't want to go to school. It's Sunday, dear. <laughs> shh, shh, let them, let them sleep. My God, stupid kids. <laughs> well, letting them sleep, not touching them. Let's talk to Lily. Come here. No running. Those two shouldn't have stayed up that late, but I should have watched them. Well, it's not an everyday circumstance. I know, but I'm just so exhausted. And I'm sure you're even more so. I really need to take a seat. If there's if there's anything you wanted to ask, just please let me sit down first. Okay, have a seat. All the way over there. <laughs> Can I talk like this? Oh, come on, you're gonna make me sit over there. Does this work? Here we go. Oh, was there something you wanted to ask? Yes! Let's ask about Lily. You know, it's pretty unusual for someone like you to work here. What does that even mean? With two children and all, I mean. It's not that bad, really. There's a school bus that passes through here. But how, how'd you even end up here? Well, after a few years ago, my husband passed away. What happened? He was in the army, and they were the last batch to be deployed overseas. Oh, that blows. Yeah, I'm sorry to hear that. I panicked. Our savings were low, the job market was grim. Johnny saw my ad and offered me this job, and I accepted with gratitude. This place was peaceful, too. It, it helped me with my grieving. Doesn't the government issue grants to war widows to help them get back on their feet? They do, and eventually I received aid. But by then, Johnny was starting to have trouble on his own, and he needed my help. Tommy and Sarah liked this place too, and so we stayed. As for Johnny, he was glad as well. Hmm. We're gonna miss him. I think deep down he really- Ooh! 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 I think deep down he really wanted a family! Ooh, woo, woo, woo. That's probably important. Tommy and Sarah? So, what are you gonna tell them about John? I... I don't know. I'll, I'll probably make something up, but it's no use. Kids are smart nowadays. They'll figure it out. I mean, might as well. It's the nature of life. There's nothing to hide. Ouch! Well, what about the future, when Johnny's dead? Well, this is your full-time job, isn't it? What are you gonna do when he- this is over? What else is there to do? Find a job in the city and live on, I suppose. It's a shame, though. I'm, I'm really gonna miss Johnny and this place. Maybe I'll come back to visit every once in a while. Huh! No more questions. Wait. Oh! Hey! Hey! What? You holding out on me? Come on! Before Johnny fell unconscious, he told me that you two would probably be coming soon. He said that he probably wouldn't get the chance himself, but he wanted me to tell you thanks for him. Oh. Oh, so thank you. Oh! Oh! Didn't say a word. I mean, I guess what's there really to say in that situation? Okay. Well, I'm gonna go see if Watts has anything going on, and if he doesn't, 
I'm gonna head back upstairs and see if Mr. Medical Doctor has anything to say, because Johnny's condition has worsened. If you take a look at the top here, it's yellow. It was green before. If you know anything about anything with video games, green is good, yellow's like caution, and then reds, you're about to die. So, Dr. Watts, hmm. What is it? It seems like our little Johnny here has some hidden records from the old days. Ooh, hidden records. Hidden medical records, to be exact. <laughs> Apparently, during his youth, he was administered a large dose of enhanced beta blockers. Ooh. And what luck! They tend to have little side effects on a curious thing called memories. <laughs> beta blockers. Johnny didn't have a heart condition, did he? Apparently not. Which leads one to wonder if the side effects were intended to be merely just that to begin with. Ooh! And in such a large amount, the impact on his memories at the time of administration must have been significant. Does mom do this to him? You think that's what kept us out of his earliest memories? Well, it's not the machine, I'll tell you that. The maintenance department yelled at me for scolding them. <laughs> so what now? I was just given the reconfiguration frequencies. That should get us past the blockers. And once we're into his childhood, we might finally be able to get early enough to transfer his desire for it to work. Uh, what are we waiting for? But uh, just one thing. What? Of course, there's always one thing. In order to activate the new frequencies, we'll need a trigger. A uh, trigger? Something that exists strongly in the bridging inaccessible memory. And we'll need to give it to John for him to stimulate his memory internally. We gotta wake him up for that or what? What, 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 what do we know about that? We've only gotten a glimpse of his childhood memories. And even if we find a childhood photo or something, John's unconscious. Yeah, back to square one. <laughs> Damn it! Thought we had something. You know, this job hasn't been such a pain in the arse for me since Nora's case last year. Likewise. <laughs> what would happen with Nora? This is killing me. I, I gotta get out to get some fresh air. Hmm. Interesting, inter- Oh, never mind! Him, you forgot my coffee. <laughs> huh. So, received a note, beta blocker. So, okay, here's what I think. I think something bad happened to Johnny, and his mom gave him some, gave him a large dose of beta blockers to wipe it out of his memory. That's my guess. I don't know, we'll figure it out. But I guess we're just gonna go do some digging. Watts is heading out that way. I'm walking real so- Oh god, it smells! <laughs> he probably smells the squirrel. <laughs> Quit barging in and out of doors. <laughs> the roadkill, Eva, it smells. I know, it's your fault for running it over. What's going on? The children are still sleeping. Watch, it's just being an idiot. Wait a minute. That last memory, the ones we're stuck at. It was the same smell. Wait, what are you two talking about? The olfactory receptors are directly linked to the brain's limbic system, Lily. Duh! <laughs> Don't you see what this means? Uh, what? <laughs> it means that smell is arguably the most effective sense for memory recall, which I knew that. I went to school. <laughs> we can use it as a stimulant to bridge his childhood memories. And, and that, that, that the best part is even though Johnny's unconscious, he is still susceptible because he's got a sniffer that still works. I, I, I think I'm missing some sort of vital piece of information. <laughs> All right, well, this is good. This is good. This is, this is awesome. Now we just need to go fetch a piece of, piece of the roadkill. <laughs> yeah, I'll just wait. Wait, why should I fetch it? You're the one who ran it over. Exactly. I've already done my part. <laughs> oh, you miserable bastard. <laughs> Um, if it helps any, I, uh... Are you gonna go get it? Are you gonna go get it? I have a pair of gloves you can borrow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is excellent. I'm loving this. They aren't really disposable gloves, but that'll probably change after this. <laughs> well, Watts, I'm gonna go yell at you real quick to see if I can get you to come with me. Watts! 
Those gloves look good on you, dear. Oh, shut your mouth. Are you just gonna stand here? At least go monitor Johnny with his doctor. No, I'll pass. Watching someone wither away helplessly doesn't really help my cup of coffee. Well, I guess we're gonna go find a dead squirrel. Who would have thought that the dead squirrel was gonna be a way to get Johnny to remember things? I didn't see that one coming. I figured the squirrel was just a way to start the game. Pretty genius. Pretty genius game developer, I'll give you that. <laughs> well, let's just go head on over to Myth the Squirrely Faith. Oh, no, no, don't go see your friend! Oh, God, deja vu. They're gonna go s Deja vu? Is there a reason for that? Because I feel like deja vu has been something we've seen a couple of times here. Or have been mentioned of. I don't know, man. Well, either way, dead bunny, dead squirrel. That might help us link back, I guess. Come here, squirrely. The kind of things this job gets me into. It's, it's not safe just to bring in a piece of germ-infected roadkill like this. There's, there's a valve container in the car. Uh, it'd at least make this odor controllable. Okay, let's get in the car. Oh, what you got, Watts? So, was that Watts' great moment? Killing a squirrel? <laughs> what? 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 Where are you going? What? I... I... I gotta go take a leak. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, what the... <laughs> Is she okay? Did what? What a mess. The crash shook, shook everything up. Let's see here. Uh, Watts, what's going on? Watts. What did you just drop? Oh, you just throwing stuff out of the car? Ah, here it is. Received a valve container. Cool. Well, uh, no. Let's get some of that dirty roadkill. What is this? Nothing? Just trash? Okay. Watts! Okay, Watts, why did you do that? What is going on? Uh, received a contained roadkill odor. Great. I don't want anything more to do with this. Okay, well this is interesting. Kind of a weird little side part to the story. But why Why is Watts freaking out? That's what's scaring me right now. Why is the dude getting all upset? I, I, I don't want to say he got upset, but he had like a, he had a, he had a calling that was like, dude, something's going on, you gotta go check it out. So Watts went to go check it out, and, oh, what's up? Oh, hey! Did you get the roadkill? It's ready. Great! Now go set it up. I'll be right back. What? Where are you going? I gotta take a leak. I gotta go feed my digital pet. What? Tamagotchi? You remember those? Oh my gosh. I used to have a Tamagotchi. Yeah, dudette. I've been feeling retro. <laughs> anyway, hurry. Go get things set up. I'll be there in no time. What are you... Uh, we, got, we got someone dying back there, Watts! What the? What the potato was he up to? <laughs> I love her words. <laughs> I've no time to check on him now. Huh? What is he do? Or do you have time? No, nothing. What is Watts up to? There's something he's up to. Are we gonna go see it, or are we gonna go check on Johnny? I hope we see what Watts is up to. I want to know. Son of a biscuit! Oh, he's back. Never mind. Best of both worlds. So when? So when we get that exact point, I'll, I'll just send the signal. When I do, I want you to release the valve for about three seconds. Certainly. What's the signal? It's like a safe word. About time you showed up. Have you made sure the germs are sealed off? Eh, fully sealed and filtered. Yeah, I suppose we don't want him getting sick right before he dies. Not like it matter to a dead man. Uh, but it might shorten his time, I don't know. You should know that Johnny's condition is deteriorating quickly. Uh-oh. That's not good. This might be your last chance, you two. Whatever you do in there, good luck. Oh. Luck's the last thing we need. Ooh, he's cocky. Well, maybe he's not cocky. Maybe he's just confident. But everything I've seen of Watts leads me to think he's just arrogant. <laughs> Act 3. I wonder how many acts there are. They shined their lights at other lighthouses and at me. I have not understood what any of these little phrases mean. They gotta be significant, though. They gotta be. Ah, there's Mamio. I get, I, okay, I don't guarantee it, but I bet ya she did something to make little Johnny forget everything. Oh, oh. Wow, I feel like I'm cheating. Thanks. 
Well, now we're in. Let's take a peek around, I guess. Backpack, nothing. mommy oh nothing. Pickles or olives, whatever. Well, I guess we gotta look at this ball here. There we go. We're just gonna bust our way back in. Oh, okay. I feel like I was supposed to look at something there. Look it. We're back even farther. We did it. We did it. To think that this little thing's causing us so much trouble. I just want to kick it to outer space. I suppose all we can do now is just send the signal and hope. Well, you ready? Let's give it a shot. Come on, sniff sniff. Raise your hand or something. Sniff sniff. There you go, buddy. Perfect. And now is the world just going to appear? Oh, God. Something's happening. Quick, send it again. Oh, no, oh, we're busting through. What's going on? Oh, God. Is it not working? Doctor, something's wrong. What? Oh, God, he's like dying, isn't he? Take over for me, Lily. Make him sniff it. No. <laughs> this condition's been destabilized. The intake levels must be reconfigured. Oh, God. Intake levels of what? The smell? What's going on? What's happening to this place? It's been destabilized. Get out. Get out. What? We can't get out, right? Get out of his memory now. What, what are you talking about? If the system doesn't restabilize soon, the shock might permanently damage who's ever in here. Ah, get out. You've got to be kidding me. Why are you not getting out then? I can't, Neil. If both of us get out under this state, all of our work will be reset. There won't be enough time to redo all we've done for just... Oh my god, no, you can't die! Don't do this shit, you freaking kidding me? Don't pull that contrived crap on me, woman! This ain't a movie, you're no hero, you're just being a moron. Now, the, 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 why, are, why are you being one too? Get the hell out of here! It's screw that, if you're gone, they'll probably pair me up with Alistair. <laughs> do you know how badly he smells? Worse than the roadkill! <laughs> Damn it, Neil, this is this is what I get for helping you cheat doing entrance exams. Ooh, 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 did they, did they, did they, uh, I think that they might be a couple. They might be a couple, come on. Doc, I'll okay, get it under control. There we go, we got it, we got it. There you go, doctor. So is this something I'm gonna have to worry about during my adventures about him, you know, just randomly dying? Come on, man. Don't make me feel like this. Don't make me feel like I can make mistakes. Just let me play the story. I think we're okay. For now. <laughs> Ooh, going back in time, going back in space. Cool. Well, we're almost there, or not at all. Son of a bitch! And guess what? Your carrot cake sucks. What? <laughs> Wait a minute. Yeah, yeah! And that last Christmas party, you... Oh. <laughs> Come on, let's go before that happens again. Um, you, you know I didn't mean to, you know, call you a moron, right? <laughs> you know that I did, right? <laughs> Can I take this with? Here goes nothing! Yeah, here goes nothing, I guess. I don't know what I'm getting myself into. I'm just going for the ride. Hmm. Well, this is Johnny's old house, I'm guessing. It's gotta be. You know, I really have no idea where this is going to get horribly sad, but I'm kind of getting nervous because you guys told me it's going to get horribly sad. Uh, well, let's go peeking around, I guess. Wow, I can't believe that worked. So we actually made it. But I'm not sure if I'm going to like this place. What, what, what do you mean? Seems peaceful enough. Neil, did you notice something odd about Johnny's room earlier? Uh, what? There was something strange in there. Did you not see it? I suppose not. Never mind. I just hope I'm wrong. I bet you she's talking about the bed. She's gotta be talking about the bed. Let's go see what she's talking about. Hello? Memories? Hello? What's up, Mommy? Ooh. Whoa. Was that just a coincidence? It got all gray when I looked at her. Okay, yeah, it's just a coincidence. Okay, well, we gotta go find a Johnny that, you know, spurs something to work. Wow, that sounds fabulous. I know, right? You gotta take him there one day. Them? Them there? Yep, somebody died. Hello? Somebody died. Kid died. Johnny had a twin, Johnny had a sister, something's dead. Nothing? Uh-oh, uh-oh. 
Oh no, you don't kick the soccer ball onto the... Oh no, is she gonna kick the soccer ball onto the road and get hit by a car? She's the time overlapping is getting out of hand. Look at how many of them are now. It's like a zoo! Mm-hmm. Okay, something bad's gonna happen here, and this this is the creepiest little ball ever. Why is it following him? Looks like the ball's moving on zone. He's just chasing it. Yeah. Okay, here's the squirrel. Here's the memory. Here's the smell. All thanks to this little fella's sacrifice. I hope. Is there something like a human that could smell as bad as a squirrel? I got a feeling, man, that something bad is really about to happen here. Like, horrible. Oh, jeez, look at the time. I'd better get going. The store closes early today. Oh, take care, Martha. Martha. Say hello to the boys. To the boys for me. I will. I'll see you around. Boys. 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 Two. Dose. Maybe three. Two. Definitely two boys. At least two. This is the end of the road. Literally. And you were saying? Never mind that. Maybe I was wrong after all. I mean, this place is just so peaceful. The only thing that exists in this memory that could do such a thing would be cars? Trucks? Shit! Duh! What? What? We need to go back now! Oh god, the music's like, Donna, Donna, Donna. Wait, what, what's going on now? Just to shut up and come! Uh, duh, uh, oh god, oh god, I'm so nervous right now. Oh god, oh god, what's gonna happen? Oh no! Oh god, 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 oh
I, I don't like it here. Let's move on. Uh, move on to what? This is, do I touch him? Yep, no, Joey. Seems like this wasn't the only memory unlinked. Odd, ah, it's not putting up a barrier anymore. Don't jinx it! So we can just transfer through. Yeah, usually we had to like go touch stuff in order for it to work. Oh, oh, memories, here we go. Going back even younger. Oh, this has probably got to be some of his earliest memories. How do you even remember something earlier than that? Dude, you should totally give this series a try. Oh, I mean, really? This is wicked awesome. I've already plowed the three books straight. What's it called? The Animorphs. Oh! <gasps> <laughs> That's so sad. We're gonna end this episode here, guys. It's time to vote. And let me know what you guys think on this one. I, I feel like it's gonna be pretty one-sided, but what do you think about Johnny's mom, or presumably Johnny's mom, giving him beta blockers? Do you think she should have done it in order to help preserve his, you know, mental state and make it so he wouldn't become severely depressed as he grew up? Or do you feel like... She shouldn't have given him the beta blockers and should have let him just live his life. And now remember, we've already seen what Johnny's life turned into, so use that when you're making your decision. Aside from that, that's all I got for now. Please leave a like on this video if you haven't already, and subscribe to the channel if you like these videos and you want to see more videos like this. And I hope that you're having a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next video. Meow. Meow. Are you gonna rope? Oh, what are you doing? Watch free pony rides in space? <laughs> I was going to vote. My name is Swingpoint, and welcome back to some more To the Moon. It's been a while, like it always is. <laughs> but what we're trying to do right now is tear up each one of these mementos.